Personnel administration there, you have mostly, let me see if I can find that section. So in that section, you have all of your retirement, um, your Social Security, your Medicare, a lot of things, once again, that are required of us. Of course, I can't find personal administration. There it is. Um, you have your employee separation cost, your buyback program, those numbers, whatever's left on those lines goes to the compensated absence fund that the trustees hold. However, as you can see this year, we're probably going to barely squeak by with enough between those two lines to cover what we've had for actual. So that's all your um, for your employee separation is retirement. So if you have a, yeah. ever have any big retirements for like this year, we had Dan Gidley, um, Kennedy at the fire department. There's been a couple yeah. of individuals who have been around a long time. So that eats up those lines. You can see we spent a hundred and. Uh, 77,000 already on that line. So, and then the buyback is for both union and non-union. We've talked about that uh, multiple times and that's in regards to selling back sick time or leave time. Um, contractual with your collective bargaining agreements and just something that's been in the personnel policy for your non-union. And then the rest of it is retirement. Uh, there is a tuition reimbursement line added there this year and then the merit pay raises uh, line is in there again this year too, mm -hmm. which has been in there in the past. Thank you. Any questions? No. Seeing none, 